Okay, let's take a look at this ordered pair and see if it is a solution or no solution for this system of equations. So when you look at the ordered pair, you always have x first and then y. So all we do is plug in these numbers into the equations. So for y, it's going to become 4 equals 4 times 1 because the 1 is the x and the 4 is the y. And then we just solve 4 is equal to 4 times 1, which is 4. Now we need to get the, another solution down here. So we're going to do the same thing. <clears throat> we have um, 4 equals 1 plus 4. Then that becomes 4 equals 5. So it is not the correct solution. So it, the ordered pair 1, 4 is not a solution, is no solution. Okay, let's look at another solution. With this, we have an ordered pair. Remember, this is x and it's y. But when we look here, we have negative 2x plus y. Uh, let's go ahead and switch it into this format, and that is y equals mx plus b. So let's get started with that. First, we need to get the y isolated. So in order to get the y isolated, we will do an opposite operation, plus 2x. So it will be 2x minus 3. And then for the other, we have y, and we're going to do an opposite operation. And that equals negative 3x plus 2. Now let's go ahead and plug in the ordered pairs. So I'm going to rewrite this. So we have the x is going to be, let me go ahead and start with the y. We have negative 1 equals 2 times 1 minus 3. And then for the second one, we have negative 1, because remember the y, equals negative 3 times 1, remember the x there, plus 3. 2. So now let's just solve. 2 times 1 is 2. Minus 3 is equal to minus 1 equals negative 1. And then negative 3 times 1 is negative 3 plus a positive 2 is also a negative 1. So for this um, example, the ordered pair 1, negative 1 is a solution to this system of equations.